shortly. Begin. Now Miss Millfield is off the course. Tyler has unfurled his flag. They're off away in racing for the second pony race of the afternoon, sponsored by Dragon TV and Film Studios. And the early leader is Tom Hutsby aboard O'Flynn's daughter in the blue cap. And alongside him is its father Ted and Mason Patel in the purple and yellow. Very keen to um, um, keep a tight grip on its father Ted as striding into the lead now is Annie Are You OK and Ryan Kokorin on the outside of its father Ted in the purple. The green colours there, a gentle dancer keeping a keen grip there is Bruce Vaughan. And on the inside rail is O'Flynn's daughter. So it is at the moment Gentle Dancer who disputes the lead of its father Ted. On the inside then is O'Flynn's daughter in fourth position. Annie, are you okay? A further length back to the Green Monk in fifth position. And then behind these comes a brick in the wall. And at the rear of the field is Bongo Bay and Ashley Lewis in the orange and red. Heading down the back straight here. Of six furlongs, maybe seven furlongs left to run. And the leader continues to be O'Flynn's daughter, but not by very much at all. To the outside in the purple is its father Ted. Then the stripes, colors of Gentle Dancer in third position. On the inside side then is the green monk with the white blaze on his head and then in the red and white is Annie are you okay sitting in fifth position just ahead of Bongo Bay in the orange and then at the rear of the field is a brick in the wall it's only about seven lengths top to tail here it's anyone's race as they continue past their halfway stage and it is they take this cambered bend which leads them into the home straight and the leader continues to be its father Ted who's won three races last year including this contest in second then is the blue cap of O'Flynn's daughter, who may now just have the lead. He has the inside rail for company. It is, it just continues to be disputed, but now its father Ted is sent on by Mason Patel with four furlongs left to run. In second then is O'Flynn's daughter, the green monk in third. In between those, the white cap of Annie, are you okay? And Ryan Kokorin now bursting through. Up the center of the course is Gentle Dancer in the green and white stripes. Ahead of Bongo Bain at the rear of the field now is a brick in the wall. Heading inside the final three furlongs now. And it's a race between these three runners. They've gone well clear here. It's Father Ted on the far side in the purple. In the centre, Annie, are you OK? Now I've moved two lengths clear of the Green Monk in third position and Harry Vigers. They come inside the final 300 yards. It's Father Ted, last year's winner, disputing this contest with Annie, are you OK? Annie, are you OK? And on the far side, it's Father Ted has the lead inside the final half furlong. It's Father Ted and Mason Patel. He won this race last year and he's going to win it again. And he may well get three wins again this season. It's a great start to the current season for it's Father Ted. He beats Annie, are you OK in second, and it's a very competitive race with the Green Monk third, and they try and in seventh place with a brick in the wall. The outcome to our second pony race is first to number nine, it's Father Ted. Second, number four. Third, number five. And the fourth place pony, number three. The provisional result to the Dragon TV and Film Studios pony race for ponies 148 centimetres and under. First, number nine, it's Father Ted, ridden by Mason Patel. Second, number four, Annie, are you okay? Third, number five, the Green Monk. And the fourth place pony, number three, O'Flynn's daughter. The distances were one and three quarter lengths and four and a half lengths. One and three quarter lengths and four and a half lengths. And the official hand start time for the winning pony was two minutes 20.54 seconds. Two minutes 20.54 seconds. 
unless you gentlemen, can we just ask for you?